Renolite phototherapeutical equipment is the only medical phototherapeutical product for the treatment of hay fever. Renolite is produced only in a desktop format. On request, however, portability is feasible. The procedure of treatment is as follows. The device can be powered with the help of the main switch at the back of the set. Switching on is carried out with the help of the standby switch on the front of the set. Following this, pushing the button on the LCD touchscreen display shows that the equipment is ready to receive the pin. This four-digit code allows only authorized medical personnel to start the device. After receiving the pin, the equipment provides the person switching on the device a welcome note by name and the menu is shown on the display. Then the source of light can be switched on. After turning the source of light on, wait 30 seconds for the light bulb to reach operational temperature. As soon as the waiting period's over, the equipment's ready for the treatment. Then the cooling fan of the equipment is switched on as well and, at the same time, the numbers indicating the treatment time to be set are shown on the display. Take the treating head out of the holder on the front and put on the nasal attachment. For each treatment, a sterile nasal attachment should be used. If a non-disposable nasal attachment is used, it must be sterilized in autoclave after each treatment. The length of the treatment can be set by the second, with the large size plus and minus button on the front. The maximum time is 3 minutes. The device does not allow longer treatments to be set. The first treatment should always last for 2 minutes. Before the treatment, the patient should always put on the enclosed UV protective glasses. The nasal attachment is placed in the patient's nostril with the help of the treating head and the treatment is started with the start button on the treating head. During the treatment, the nasal cavity is continuously panned with circling movements using the treating head. The patient doesn't feel either pain or heat. The aim is to expose to the light as much of the surface of the nasal cavity as possible. During the treatment, the progress of the treatment can be followed by watching the light shining through the skin of the patient's nose. After lighting up both nasal cavities, the treatment is finished. The nasal attachment is removed and disposed of as soiled. The treating head is placed back in the holder. The light source and finally the equipment is switched off. The treatment is given four to six times, usually within a period of two weeks. Patients are advised to apply vitamin A oil to the mucous membrane after the treatment to prevent the drying of the membrane, the only side effect of the treatment. Renalite therapy is uniquely efficient and is protected by a patent.